Hey guys, Hyper D Kaiser here. Um, here with the deck profile that you guys asked for from the Royal Paladin player that I played last week. So uh, I guess we'll get started with the Greed Zeros. The starter is Sparkle, just okay. because. Until he's banned, might as well. well I guess first you'd be. <laughs> All right. Um, I run for Lou, just because he looks pretty. Mm-hmm. Two Epona, make it six crits. Alrighty. I actually run stand triggers. Three pi three pipe a fife and drum. Mm -hmm. I, um, because I figure with the way the deck runs, when you get a stand and he's on the field and he's already been boosted, extra five thousand on a three thousand make it a make it a seventeen That's rather fine. than rather than a straight up. Uh, 13, I think. I'm bad at math, like I said. <laughs> um, so, three Pipe, eight, Fife, and Drum. Three Flogel. Obviously, for the superior ride. And four Yggdrasil. Four heal. So, that was six stands at crit, six crit, and four heals. Not a pretty standard for uh, Paladins, usually. Alright, now obviously four flash shields for the grade ones. Start it off. Mm -hmm. Two pongle, just because it helps put stuff in the soul, gets me soul saver. And if Lohung runs out, and if uh, the other boosters are out there, you know, it's added to the soul, gets it, uh, increases it. Marin, just because Marin's badass. 8k vanillas all, all, the, all day, every day. All right, and here's the star of the deck. Four young Pegasus Knights. All right, now explain to me exactly why you run uh, the four Pegasus Knights. Honestly, it's in combination with, with Lahungren. Every turn, you uh, soul charge, and whenever a card is moved into the soul, this guy gains 3,000. He's a 6,000 original. One card from this guy makes it a 9,000 bo booster, and if he's behind Lahungren's, uh, he gets a 2,000 for the soul charge, so it's a 21 for a Vanguard, and that's at least a 10k block even on a Kagro or uh, on an 11k Vanguard, so that's pretty pretty broken. That it is, sir. <laughs> um, that's it for the grade ones. On to the grade twos. Grade twos. I run three Gordon. I, rare, I actually rarely use him. I probably would, if I need to switch anything, he would probably come out. Hmm. 8,000 8, is a little weak at the moment. Yeah. Uh, only had room for two Blaster Blades. Like I said, if I take a uh, Gordon out, I might add another Blaster Blade. Not sure. Because the deck doesn't rely on the Blaster Blade combo completely, so... Yeah. Three Gallatin. Just because I have other grade twos I like that, that work better with the deck, and always 10k is always nice to have, but you don't need four of them. Yeah. And the grade two of Young Pegasus, three Baron. Only went to three, four seemed like overkill. Yeah. Because if you want four, you have to probably take out a Gallatin. Yeah. I, I tried it. Not that good. Yeah. Now for the grade threes. All right. Two Alfreds. Helps me get a Pegasus Knight. Yeah. That's really it. Because especially since you could use it in the rear guard. Yeah. Makes it so much nicer. Two Soul Saver. Since you're building up soul, might as well. Yep. You, know, you, s you, sit, you hold on to him until the end, until you're ready to put him away. So broken. <laughs> and the ace of the deck for the Hungrins. Now he is pretty much, yeah, like you said, the ace of the deck. Uh, the whole, pretty much most of the great twos and ones, like the main ones you use, revolve pretty much around him since he around soul his charges. Effect, yeah. I think I've maybe ever since I started playing this deck only used the, the Mega Blast once and that was just because I couldn't draw an Alfred <laughs> and, and I think I healed the the, the, the blaster the uh, Lou counter blast so wow. uh, I think I only used it once huh? but but I uh, most of the time it's just for the soul charging for the uh, for the other guys all right then uh, that is the deck that uh, you guys asked for so as you can see it's very innovative and much different from most paladin builds and it I'm, I'm not gonna lie. There were, there were I got the idea from from uh, someone on YouTube, Scarecrow Kaiser. No 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 relation, but uh, yeah, he he gave me the idea. It's pretty much a similar version to his, just not exactly. I changed it around a little bit for my playstyle. But 
either way, it's still different from most builds out there. So it's, I, I don't, I don't like the Lake Maiden. I think it's like why, why get rid of a card to draw a card? Yeah, it's useful sometimes, but you know, I don't know. I just think there are better great ones. All righty, uh, yes, that will, I guess, end the video here with that, and uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. So, and I will catch you later. Peace.